Well, hello everyone, I'm National Freak, and today I'm here with another how-to tutorial on how to use Mac X DVD Ripper Pro. Now, what this is, is essentially a DVD ripping software. Now, the people at Digiterity, Digiterity, I cannot, I have a very bad lisp and dyslexia, so I apologize if I am completely butchering your name, but they were kind enough to send me this program and another that I will also be covering to teach you how to use it in a fun and clever way. Now, I don't know what there is to teach you because this program is just so unbelievably simple to use. It's literally a DVD ripping program and it can put it into any format you want. So today I'm going to be showing you how to rip a copy of The Goonies because I have a copy of The Goonies and I love that movie. So we're going to go ahead and do it. So I'm going to pop it into my disk drive. Now, if you're on a Mac, whenever the DVD loads, it's going to automatically go into the DVD player and it's going to start playing the movie. So you just want to get out of that real quick and you're not going to want to deal with that unless you want to sit and watch the movie before you rip it. I mean, before you rip it a, a new one. See, there we go. It's already loading. We'll exit out and we'll uh, close that so once you're closed out of that you're gonna want to go into your program right here and look at it it's ready to go you're just gonna want to click this little thing called DVD and since the Goonies is the only one in the system right now you're just gonna want to click OK and now it's gonna analyze and then you're going to be able to after this select the format you want to put it in so you can put it into MP4 format right now, but you can also put it into all these formats, like mobile formats, web formats, or other different kinds of formats. And you can do it in high quality, low quality, depending on how fast you want your movie, what quality you want it, what screen you're watching it on, and you have so many options to use. So we're just gonna go ahead and stick with the recommended settings and let, let it go with that. So we click that, and then you can also pick what chapter of the movie or chunk of the movie you want to see. So basically, I'm just going to go in and I'm just going to go ahead and click all of the chunks of movie. So we have the whole movie on here and ready to go. And after that, you're going to want to go over here to this big old button that says run. Click it. Now, this is an hour and an hour long movie or more than an hour long. So it is going to take some time. So you're going to want to give it a little while. So we're going to head back. Once this is all done, I'll show you what happens after that. All right, so it just finished ripping the DVD and it automatically opened this window. If it was on Windows software, I have no idea what it did. But me stupidly forgot to click the merge titles option, which basically I clicked all the titles instead of clicking this and it broke the movie up into chapters, which isn't a big deal. I can always just redo it and it'll work perfectly fine. But let's see if it works. So we'll click on the first one. Did that instead. Nope. Oh. All right, look, it worked. It worked perfectly great. Perfectly great. And that is how you use Mac X DVD Ripper Pro. Now, that is just the basic tutorial. It is so freaking simple to use. Now, you, I will leave links in the description of where to download this program. There's a free trial. And with that free trial, you get all sorts of awesome features that you get to use. So thank you to Digiarity. If I am pronouncing that wrong, I apologize, but thank you to them. Go check out their website and get this program for yourself. There is a Windows and Mac version available. So go check it out. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you in another video. Peace out, goodbye, namaste.